morning all, just checking in. So, this day I was a little bit melancholy, a bit, a bit down about a few things, and um, I've woken up this morning, the sun's shining, the sky's blue, and um, I know I have to play golf. So, I've got to try and, as I said, do everything for these people that can't, but also make sure that I'm doing everything to my best ability. Whatever I do, just do it to the max. It's a bit of a Sunday morning um, thing when you you know you get to the end of the week and you're, you're thinking, right, this is the beginning of the new week. And as we say, as I've said before, time and time again, it's best to make goals for each week, goals for each day sometimes, but just making sure that we're trying to push on as positively and um, healthily, uh, both mind and body, and, and trying to make sure that we get to the point where we're giving everything. You know, give everything you can. Obviously, still listen to your body. You know the times when you need to stop, you need to put the handbrake on, you need to just go back down to third gear and just, just chill out for a little bit. But give everything you can, you'll feel better about it. The, the next thing, which again is something I still haven't looked into, is that always try at least, well, I, I, I try and do it through my life, but always try and help somebody every single day. It, it's incredible how being helpful and being attentive to other people's needs helps you in your own mental psyche as well as helping them so it may sound stupid it may sound dark oh I'm, I'm helping you to help me but a bit Jerry Maguire a little bit but you just people we all need help even though you know we say we don't sometimes we all need help along the line along the way along along our path so just the offer and sometimes when you know that person that well and they say, oh no, no, don't worry about it. Just be there, be there for them. I've got this little plan. I don't know how it's gonna work, but I've got, a, you know, I've got 14,000 different plans. You must know me by mid now. I, I, I start lots of plans and, and some of them, some of them go forward and some of them don't. Um, but I've got a little plan to bring in a way of helping a lot of people in this world um, because there's something fundamentally wrong with our civil civilization it sounds it sounds really deep and like I say it's a bit of a Sunday morning sermon but it sounds it sounds really strange to say that but it's so true how can 300 people in Haiti just been died just just been killed with an earth by an earthquake and I'm driving on on a sunny Sunday morning to go and play golf. It doesn't it doesn't make sense. And if it does make sense, then there's something seriously wrong. There's got to be a way that we can put more balance in the life in in our lives. Whereas these people who are massively lower you know it's in, it's in this country as well I'm not saying it's all over you know it's not just it's just third world countries or whatever you know I've I'm I'm 48 years old I ever since I've been six all the way through my school years I've been told that the third world countries need help that's over 40 years and nothing has changed there's still a fundamental gap between the rich and the poor, or the 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 well-off who uh, I you know I, I'm well off because I'm healthy, and I'm also you know it's not just being healthy; it's also being lucky that I'm in this place and, and in this time that I am. But it's all you know these these people are born into massive poverty massive and they need you know just fundamental food and water to survive healthcare 
we we really don't believe and don't understand how lucky we are with what we've got because it it is just round the corner people just round the corner that everything can change for us the whole thing can just go oh there we go budge um i don't mean that really I, I, I just think that we need to break that barrier and within the next two years within by the time i'm 50 years old i promise that i will address that situation i'm not having my children go through you know my boys are four that'll be five this year and i'm not having them for the next 40 years being told well you know so ethiopia needs needs help this needs help we need to help now we need to help each other now and that starts by helping your neighbor today that little bit that we've just learned we've just had 18 months of helping each other and 18 months of actually learning that this is a really really good thing to do and yet we still haven't learned we're still rushing around we're still taking the mickey out of each other we're still doing all this stuff it's it's really really frustrating we just i just really i just want us to 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 be one again I, i'm really i don't know if it's again i just want us to be one fair, full stop anyway i'll get off my high horse with a super top tempo it's on a roll it's time to go solo roll it i'm gonna go take care Enjoy your Sunday. Um, we're going to go to the fair. Hey! Bye.